Hello out there, Tails Tubers. It's been a little while. Did you miss me? Well, I'm back with a very special episode. Today, I've got a guest you've all been asking for. The one and only Knuckles the Echidna. Is this thing working? Hello? Can you hear me? Coming in loud and clear. Glad to see my video communicator arrived safely. Can you hear me? Uh, okay, yeah, yeah. Uh, uh, sorry, I'm not good with the uh, technology. Now, what did you need? Are you in danger? No, no, nothing that serious. I was just hoping you'd be able to hang out for a bit. This is my show, The Sonic Scoop, where we talk all about Sonic. Oh, no thanks. Uh, what? I don't want to talk about Sonic. Is that all? How do I turn this thing off? Wait, wait, uh, I guess we don't have to talk about Sonic. We can talk about, well, what do you want to talk about? Pretty much anything else. Well, you're the guest. Let's talk about you. Why don't you tell us a little about yourself? Well, there's not much to tell. I'm a pretty simple guy. The last in a line of ancient guardians entrusted with watching over the Master Emerald, a jewel of immeasurable power and the only force in the universe that can neutralize the energy of the Chaos Emeralds. Uh, yeah, pretty simple. The Master Emerald also keeps your island floating in the air, right? That's right. High in the sky, hidden away in the clouds. It's the safest place to guard the Emerald from fiends who would try to take it. Like Eggman. <laughs> Eggman, robotic abominations, the thieving bat. Uh, Rouge? Where? I mean, uh, yes. None of them are worthy of possessing the Emerald. I'll do whatever it takes to keep it safe and out of dangerous hands. Sure, sure. But what if... Say, one of your friends came up to run a few tests? See what else it can do? Oh, well, then I'm glad that friend can fly, because he'd be getting tossed right off the side of my island. <laughs> but aren't you curious about what else the Master Emerald can do? You have such a special relationship with it. Sonic can use the Chaos Emeralds to turn into Super Sonic, after all. With your connection to the Master Emerald... It is not my place to use the Emerald's power. It is my job to protect it. Come on. Where's your sense of adventure? <laughs> You've been hanging out with Sonic too much. You're starting to sound like him. And what's so wrong with that? Oh, hey, Sonic. Hmm. I should have known you'd show up. Oh, you happy to see me, Knucklehead? You're not getting lonely up there, are you? You know, we could come visit. No, thanks. All right, then. Why don't you come visit us? Come on, get off that stuffy old island once in a while. Hey, I leave my island plenty, and it's always to help when you can't save the world on your own. Well, that's not untrue. And my island is not stuffy. It's a paradise with diverse environments and ancient mysteries to uncover. Every day I find something new and fascinating here. For example, here's a special new rock I just found. Look what it can do. Oh! Uh, my communicator! I don't know, I, I feel like any rock could do that. Oh, well, I guess that's the end of my interview. Sorry, buddy, I didn't mean to interrupt. I'm sure Knuckles was gonna talk about a, a another really interesting rock or something next. Well, that's okay. I'm glad you stopped by, actually. I was doing some research on the Chaos Emeralds, and their signal led my tracker to someplace strange. It looks like some new islands I've never seen before. Wanna come check it out? Sounds like an adventure. I'm in. Oh, wait, let me do the thing. I'm in. Great. Well, thanks for tuning in, everyone. We'll see you next time for another Sonic Scoop. Should we invite Amy, too? Hey, the more the merrier.